Just hearing from the UK's Health Security Agency that the UK's first human case of the flu strain H1N2, which has been circulating in pigs, has been detected. So this is serious because it's moved from uh, pigs into uh, the human population. It's a single confirmed human case, according uh, to the UK Health uh, Security Agency. Um, it's uh, influenza is similar to the flu virus, is currently circulating in pigs. Uh, as is usual, early in this emerging infection, uh, the UK HSA is working closely with partners to work out the characteristics of the pathogen and assess what risks it poses to human health, uh, because they're not sure on that. They say that the case was detected as part of a routine national flu surveillance. Uh, the individual concerned experienced a mild illness and has now fully recovered. Uh, the source of their infection hasn't yet been ascertained and remains under investigation. Just quickly scanning through it, not telling us whereabouts in the UK it was, it says, but it says that anybody who has any respiratory symptoms should con continue to follow existing uh, guidelines, avoiding contact with other people, etc. Um, so this is just to confirm uh, from the Chief Veterinary Officer uh, and the UK Health Security Agency that uh, this disease has transferred from animal to human. It says that this does happen often, uh, but this is why high standards of animal health, welfare and biosecurity are important important. Uh, a little bit of background on the influenza virus. Um, they uh, are enzootic in swine populations in most areas of the world. Uh, and when an influenza virus that normally circulates in swine is detected in a person, it is called a variant influenza virus. So just to bring you that breaking news again in uh, simple terms, the first human case of the flu strain, uh, which has been circulating in pigs, has been now detected in a human, according to the UK Health Security Agency. And we'll bring you more on that as we get it.